Alrighty folks, welcome back to another Modern Warfare beta video, however, as of now, weekend one of the beta is now over and I don't know about you, but I personally don't know what to do with my life right now, I am lost without this game. And those three days we have to wait until weekend two of the beta kicks off will feel like three years, however, before the first beta drew to a close, like literally within the last 30 minutes of it being up, uh, basically in my final game I decided to play as selfish as possible and capping flags, playing the objective, pfft, no my problem. And let's be honest, it's not as if many other people are making capping the B flag a priority in their life playing this game. In fact, most people have totally abandoned the idea of actually moving from a room corner, so I slapped on the highest streaks available to us in the beta. I'm talking VTOL aka the Harrier, the Chopper Gunner aka the Chopper Gunner, and the Support Helo aka the Pavlo. To see just how many kills we can rack up, what do you think? 50? 60 maybe? Well, you'll just have to wait and see, but I do want to make a huge disclaimer. Nah, bigger than that, Marley. Yeah, that's, a, that's about right. I am an objective player at heart, right? My fellow objective runners, I'm still one of the good guys. So with that said, I'll leave you in the capable hands of earlier Marley for now. This is the best line of sight in the game, by the way, folks. Just telling you that right now. You can take advantage of it in weekend two of the beta. I'm currently one off my Harrier strike right now. How have they got a VTOL? Come on! I'm one off of mine. Do you know what? Use it as inspiration, Gary. Use it as inspiration. Where the hell are they? Why are they not pouring out that line of sight that I've just praised? Thank fuck. Right. I need that to go away now and then we can maybe, maybe start pushing up a little bit. Thank you. Here comes some more enemies for me. Oh my god! I was a bit lucky. I've got the chopper gunner though, and I'm out. Let's get this VTOL called in. Uh, where are they spawning? I think... I'll let my teammates get B. Put it right over B. Got the support halo now. Look at that, there's like three enemies pushing for me there. Did you see that? Did you see those like three enemies pushing for me? Oh no! Okay, I died. That's what I've got all my killstreaks. We need to start them again. The killstreaks don't wrap in this game. That is all good, that's like one of the best things that could have happened to me there. Now at this point, I'm killstreaked out of my fucking mind, folks. I've got more firepower chilling in my back pocket than some small countries have in their entire armed forces. This match should be a breeze from this point forward, and as you can see, my lust for killstreaks has now been satisfied. I'm hopping on flags once more, but it soon becomes apparent my teammates aren't interested in helping with that, despite them not even throwing up any streaks at all of their own. Team! Stop just running past this flag, I know I, I did that earlier, but come on. Like, come on now, if, if you're gonna abandon the objective to slay out, you actually need to hold up your end of the bargain and get slain, otherwise, what are you doing? That's it. Listen to that thing, man. I can't, I, I can't hear shit causing my heli. Just look at it as well. Where do you think you're going? My helicopter was shooting this way. <laughs> I said, keep those kills coming. What the hell? Oh my god! There's so many kills! Jesus Christ! Time for some chopper gunner action now. <laughs> right, let's see what we can do with this. Oh, they're actually all in there! Oh my god! That's it, run! Run! Run the lotties, come on team, let's try and get that B flag. Where the hell are they spawning at? Where the hell are they spawning at? They're still spawning at A. Ah, can I get him? I love the missiles. I absolutely love using the missiles. They're so effective. But team, we need to push up. Why are we not pushing up? Why he's not pushing up? Where the hell are they as well? Ah, <laughs> oh, there's actually no one to shoot at. Is there anyone even in the game? Look at the hard carry by my team right now, although we're getting beat. I need my team to get that B flag. We've got it. Right. That's now my objective, to go and help my teammates out. Can't do anything right now, folks. Come on. We can still win this game. We can still win this game. Oh. So, yeah, by the end of the game, my heart was in the right place. Honestly, it was, but the enemy team had got us right where they wanted. 
They had their big size 11 boot right on our throat and we are struggling to breathe under the weight of kill streaks they've got and the ever increasing points on the board. Bear in mind this is despite me having a VTOL, Chopper Gunner and Support Halo all in the go during this game. I guess the, the moral of the story is play the objective if you want to win. But does it serve me right that this punishment at the end of what should have been a good game, this, this could have been a 50 plus kill game easy easy if we had more control of the objective. Instead, I began to rack up some deaths. Granted, in any case, my teammates weren't the best, so I'm not sure how much of a difference me not going for streaks would have made, but why did I even make this video? Why does it matter? Why does anything matter, really? In 7 billion years, the sun will eat the earth and there will be no trace of this one single Call of Duty Modern Warfare beta match of domination on Grasna Raid left for anyone or anything to care about, and that actually makes me feel a little better. But for fuck's sake, that guy really went 10 for 18 with one capture. If you're new here and enjoyed this video, including the monologue at the end, why not consider hitting that subscribe button as well as the notification bell to join the notification squad like the two Call of Duty demons on your screen right now. We are an absolute band of quality COD players on this channel, isn't that right folks? Right? Let them know. Let them know in the comments. A uh, like on this video would also be much appreciated. One like equals one respect for the sun turning into a red giant. Have a nice day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.